there are three aspects one is praises stuti is singing the glory of the divine by singing the glory you sing glory of anybody what happens to you your consciousness expands your consciousness gets elevated so to elevate our consciousness we sing the glory of divinity that gives us immense pleasure and it kindles deep love now you love someone then you keep talking about them like that you talk when you praise it kindles the love inside of you devotion inside of you. second is prarthana prayer prayer is whatever is your need or whatever is your botheration offering all that to the divine so when you pray what happens all that you want you have offered you have become free from desires from wishes because when you have prayed knowing that your prayer will be granted then will you keep the wish again no imagine it's already fulfilled when a wish is fulfilled it's gone no and if it's not the right wish then divine knows that mother knows that it's not to be fulfilled and she will take care of it so offering our fear anxiety our desires wishes everything is prayer and then upasana there is no word for upasana in english so we have to use the same word upasana is creating a relationship with the divine connecting with the divine in a very deep sense you are part of it and the divinity is part of you everything is mother divine the intellect the memory even the confusion even the confusion is mother divine so recognizing the divinity in everything and in yourself connecting with the divinity establishing a deep sense of connection with it is called upasana so these three things is together bhajan and that is what makes life a celebration where you are free from all that you want to be free from hmm and realize that you are totally dependent on the divinity this is the way to invoke love and devotion in ourselves and this festival is to invoke devotion invoke the truth that all is one and that one is everything this truth god is not difficult to achieve you should not strain yourself to achieve god god is already here so all that you need to do is in the here and now relax only in deep rest divinity dawns not by doing too many things in deep rest divinity dawns and the navratri is the celebration of this recognition i am that i am she and she is me and she is everything the whole universe is all permeated by divinity he is of divine deep acceptance and total rest deep peace this is the way to realize god who is here and now yeah but what stops us from doing that our mind our desires so stuti praising the divine prarthana offering all your desires free from desires and then upasana getting connected to the divinity divine is anyway connected to you have to simply recognize the connection hmm and then life becomes celebration take it there then no now now life becomes a celebration
not then, now. You have to do this now, right away, right?